Top of the morning. Welcome back to Javon Salah Products LLC. Hope all is well wherever you at. Beautiful day. Patience. That's the subject. It's the topic we're talking about today. Very important. Right? Because we live in a time now where everything is so fast and watered down. Right? We have lost the taste of patience, the value of patience. And patience is the game of the master. Only masters can play this game, right? Now, patience is like cooking in the oven. And impatience is like cooking food in a microwave. You see, you could get the food fast in the microwave, but it don't taste as good as when you take your time and let it bake in the oven. You know the difference when you bake chicken nice and slow? For anybody that cook maybe on a 200, 300 heat, you bake it for about, about uh, maybe six to seven hours it bakes slow notice how the the flavor the juices how it all marinate inside the chicken and it becomes one with the chicken to as you can actually taste the juices coming out of your mouth when you eat the chicken this is the reward of patience but see when you rush the process like the microwave you get it faster but you can't even enjoy the food right and i like patience because patience allowed me to become the person that i am today and to continue to make incremental growth as far as my personal self-development as a person right this is the most important thing for me right because nobody could take that away from me you see for example, the Federal Reserve could print money, but nobody could print patience. <laughs> that's why it's so beautiful, because that's something that you have to master within yourself, right? And I like to study successful entrepreneurs, business owners like Charlie Mung and Warren Buffett. That's my game, right? I'm not looking for the quick come up. I'm not influenced by a lot of these fake fucking gurus, all these ads that you can see on YouTube and Facebook and, you know, they sell you all these fucking dreams and shit like that. Only fools fall for this, right? Fools that don't study, fools that don't have patience, fools that's looking for a quick come up. But for people that understand patience understand nature this is why i come to the park very often as y'all can see i'm in the park regular routine because this reminds me of the process of having patience look at the trees if you focus on the tree if you look at the tree right if you look at the tree how long you think, think it took for this tree right here to grow? Come on, let's take a look at this pretty, this pretty tree right here. Look, this tree right here. How long you think it, how, how long you think it took it to grow? This is the game of patience. So when, it, when I come to the park, it allows me to remember is a reminder of the process of the tree to connect with nature to connect with nature, the virtue of patience, right? Nothing good comes easy and quick. If it's too good to be true, more than likely it is, right? And this is, again, why I study, study people like Charlie Mung and Warren Buffett because they're very old, right? They, you know, the tremendous value that they provided for the business world, and they're going to be greatly missed. I know for me personally, when they depart from this world, man. And I'm so happy 
they added so much value into my life, man, just by the books that I read and just studying their career and the things that they've been through and the things they had to endure and just the hardships that they went through and the different cycles and different times from the 70s, from the 80s, even up to our time right now, right? The whole process of Warren Buffett building Berkshire Hathaway, you know, I admire that process and that has so much value into my life because I said to myself that the reason why that these two businessmen were so successful because they are prudent investors and they have patience, right? And they know when to strike. They are fierce when it's time to strike, you know? So this is a very important attribute to have. And anybody that understand patience understand there's no such thing as a quick come up. Right? If anybody came up quick, if any got if anybody blew up quick, got rich overnight, a lot of times they lose it, right? Because the the, the process has no value. Repeat, the process has no value, so this is why it don't really have no weight behind that which they accumulated. Because it didn't revolve a process of developing mental muscle and emotional stability right and this is why again why i study charlie munger and warren buffett because they are old men 90 96 years old charlie munger and this is the process that i like the slow process i don't want no quick process and i want people in my team that want a quick process if you're looking for a quick process, go to fuck somewhere else, right? Not at Jerome's Lab Products. I believe in patience.